Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to the local Las Vegas music scene and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and on Friday, February 7th of this year, I went down to Backstage Bar and Billiards on Fremont Street in downtown Las Vegas to check out a live show from my recent interview guests, Dirt Halo. You can check out their interview here. With a solo acoustic opener, Dirt Halo laying down some metal shenanigans, and a national southern rock band headlining, the show had a little bit of everything and was well worth the ticket price. What I paid for parking, on the other hand... If you're enjoying the content Room 6 is putting up, please make sure you subscribe down there and hit the bell so you don't miss an episode. While you're at it, feel free to like and share. And uh, yeah, let's go. Having already reviewed their EP House of Broken Glass on this channel, link is up there in the corner, I was prepared for Dirt Halo to melt my face off. But first, things got a little mellow, courtesy of Jonathan Salas, a last minute acoustic opening act whose talent and range had the crowd singing along to familiar cover songs and enjoying his originals. And then came the rock. Dirt Halo had a decent contingent of fans there just waiting for them to take the stage, and the boys wasted no time in getting down to business. Opening with Lifeline, the infectious and riff-heavy first song from their new EP, the band had everyone in the palm of their hands from the get-go, and proceeded to squeeze us just right. The band continued the straight-ahead rock attack, moving through their catalog with one notable dip in the cover song pool with Sober by the band Tool, which they completely nailed. For longtime fans of Dirt Halo, Here's a pick of the set list, along with a signed broken drumstick from their previous show. Jealous? While I didn't recognize some of their older stuff, I enjoyed it all. By the time they wrapped up their set, we all wanted more. Unfortunately, the price you pay for the coveted metal slot at a show is having to stop when they say you're done. But believe me, boys, you left us hungry to see you play again. The last act, or headliner, was national act Blacktop Mojo, hailing from Texas. They drew a surprising amount of local transplants that knew them from back home. They were consummate professionals on stage, and I was impressed and a little sad I had to leave before their set was done. All in all, it was a great show and a great night. From Justin Calloway's driving bass lines to RJ Hammond's theatrical and energetic drumming, to Bobby Santon's emotional guitar and vocal outpourings, Dirt Halo deserves all the good things. Make sure you click the link in the description below and get their EP House of Broken Glass today. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and that you'll check out Dirt Halo's EP, House of Broken Glass, by clicking on the link in the description below. In the meantime, if you want to check out more from them, click here. If you'd like to subscribe to this channel, please click here and don't forget to ring that bell. Remember to be amazing and we'll see you next time on Room 6.